Hi folks, I'm back, back in Oslo as I promised, and here with my son. Hi folks. Where are we? Yeah. Where are we going? Now we're on the way to Oslo Street Food. It's an underground food court in the middle of Oslo city center. Well, let's see what's on the menu there today. Yeah, we are going out, going out to eat some good food. So, then we see you at the food court. Unexpected. Huh? I didn't expect that many people on uh, first uh, afternoon. I heard it was a lot of people. Changing plans. That was a bust. <laughs> that was a crowded place. Cannot show you too much from in there because of the music. So I think we are only allowed like 10 seconds of music. Now we find another place to eat. So see you later. Oh, yeah. There's a place called Koyera. So, Tamravi. Well, here it was too crowded. Yeah, it turns out I'm the worst navigator in Oslo. So we went out to find another restaurant. We went walking. And we was following the GPS. And we're back where we started. About one kilometer? Uh -oh. Yeah. We will find another restaurant somewhere. If it helps now, I know exactly where we're going. I think. I think we are going to actually a Vietnamese restaurant. That was the plan. It's called How. Yeah. We'll see about that. Yay! We found a place to eat. Finally. So Where we are we? We are in uh, Majorstuhl in Oslo, one of the better parts of town. And we found a Vietnamese place we're going to try out. So I think after uh, 10 minutes now, we finally decided on the menu. So let's just wait till the uh, waiters get here, so we can order. Um, we actually been in Vietnam. Yeah, too, so it's nice to try and taste uh, Asia again. But we are not able to go to Vietnam now, so Vietnam came to us. We'll show you the food when it uh, arrives. So I'm here with my son and his wife and I really want to ask my son a few questions huh? you actually have the have the same job as me I did for six years yeah six years and you moved from Lilame and into Oslo together with Oh, darling wife. He's good wife. <laughs> How is Oslo compared to Lilamu? Well, uh, much more variety here. You know, to say that life here, for me personally, it's much better. I don't know exactly how to put words on it, but just like more exciting days here. So just uh, Lilamu for me is a very quiet place and here something's happening all the time. Yeah. You don't miss your old work? Uh, no, by no means. <laughs> what do you do in Oslo? Well, I have, I have various... As your work? Yeah, for me, I'm basically what I do is drive cars from point A to point B for rental shops, private people that needs the car serviced and stuff like that. So basically I'm just a driver. This is Vietnamese iced coffee. 
in the local language that uh, pronounced cafe soda and that tastes very good it's uh, actually strong vietnamese coffee and sweet condensed milk and um, ice always drink that when i'm in vietnam so cheers is it good that's good Show me your plate, Tom Robin. Ah, that's uh, hot wings. Looking very good. This is Vietnamese spring rolls with uh, sweet chili sauce. And that's noodle soup. This uh, some kind of noodle soup with uh, I think it was pork, I don't remember, to be honest, from the menu. And uh, shrimp dumplings. This looks very good. The restaurant name is uh, Hao. And this is... What street is this? It's... Kirkevein. It's... Yeah, I can. I will leave the address in the um, down below in the description. The plates are empty. Come here and eat. If you are in Oslo, come here and eat. Very good food if you like uh, like Vietnamese Asian food. Yeah, try the hot wings. Very good. So we will wrap it up here and. Uh, I think the king is asleep. But if it's true what I read in the news, he actually infected with COVID now. Again? Again? I think it's the second time the king is uh, sick. So. Yeah, we will. Uh, So if you are wondering, this is today's exercise. We've been walking around uh, Grönland in Oslo to never find the restaurant. And now we've eaten on that Vietnamese restaurant in Majorstua and now we are going by the castle. So that's an okay walk for today. He learned from me, lie on the ground and take pictures. <laughs> Did you get your picture? Yes. That reminded me of someone. Who? Clarkson? <laughs> <laughs> he 
Yes. The royal family actually live up there. So they live here at the castle. To eat a solid meal and then uh, go for a walk that's that's uh, something Carl Johan Street by night little bit chill outside but actually it's very nice to be outside that in yesterday's uh, video that I was going to be a tourist in Oslo I have been in Oslo many times but uh, not to walking around with the camera I think uh, visiting here must be the most touristy thing you can do in Oslo as well to visit the castle yes yeah. I guess this is it for tonight so we will find our way home from here and we will see we yeah we now I can see we will <laughs> we will see you tomorrow bye for now Tourist in my own capital city. Yeah. Is it open? Far from the castle. Yeah, you can see there.
Huh? Let's see if we find a suitable t-shirt to go with it. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we find a t-shirt uh, to match it. I think it's okay. No, we might, um, that one's also cool, cool though. Mm -hmm. That one? Maybe that one? Which one do you like? I like this one. Well, then you should go for that one. That's 8XL. What? You're not that big. No. Yeah, no, that's good. Three yeah, XL. Sure, you happy? Now we can go to the gym. Yeah, let's go. Hold it up. Smug. Strug.